when I had my PSA tested during the color Doppler ultrasound, I also had my gland volume measured. And I was told of what's called a predicted PSA score based on that gland volume. And as it was explained to me that as men age, the prostate grows, which in turn makes your PSA go up normally. That's natural. But in the case of having BPH or prostatitis, which I have had and do have, um, that makes your gland volume increase even more, which correspondingly should make your PSA also increase. So it was told to me that based on my gland volume that I should actually have a PSA in the eight to nine range, where in fact it's been in the four to five range. So that to me only confirms uh, the fact that the, the 4.0 crossover point that's used so often to determine whether you're in danger or not really does not apply because it's too individualistic for a man his age and his gland volume to just simply say because you've crossed into four suddenly you know you the red flags go up